to hear, make a pledge, I would be respectful. Focused and engaged, making me successful. Playing it safe is up to me. Following the rules is my responsibility. Today I make a pledge, I will be respectful. Focused and engaged, making me successful. Playing it safe is up to me. Following the rules is my responsibility. Good morning, Good morning Cougars. Cougars. I am Wyatt Council. I am Allie Davis. Today is Tuesday, October 3rd, 2023. Our thought for today comes from an unknown author. When you talk, you are only repeating what you already know. But if you listen, you may learn something new. Let's make today about learning something new. Listen. On October 3rd, 1960, The Andy Griffith Show was debuted on American television and it was immediate success also on this day. In 1990, after four decades of Cold War division and with the pressure from the German Chancellor Helmut Kohl, Soviet leader Mikhail Gorbachev agreed to a unified Germany with the NATO, leading to German's reunification. In 1995, one of the most sensational trials in U.S. history ended as jury found O.J. Simpson not guilty. Today's lunch is Philly cheesesteak or chicken nuggets with roll, oven roasted squash and zucchini, glazed carrots and assorted fruits. Happy birthday to Luis Garcia Sanchez in fourth grade and, Le and Lino Soto in fifth grade. We hope you both have great days. This afternoon, the volleyball team will play the second home game of the week against the Chocolini. Let's be in attendance to cheer them on to victory. The football team plays an away game on Wednesday at Chocolini. The game starts at 5.30. Sports is such a, good, such a part of our lives, and we want to take a moment to share some history of the sports we play here in the U.S. The first recorded sport in history, spear throwing, is a cross in 70,000 BC out of need hunters for hunters to practice their skill. The origin of volleyball can be traced back to a humble beginning in 1895, Massachusetts. It was created by William D. Morgan. Organized Varieties. Varieties of football began to take form in the 19th century in English published schools. According to the legend, William Webb Elias picked up the ball and ran it with dirt, ran with it during a school football match in 1823, thus creating a new style of playing in which running with the ball Predominated. Predominated instead of kicking. There's another sport known as football. It is called soccer. Professional soccer has been around in England since the 1800s, but some say the game was created 2,000 years ago by the Aztecs using a rubber ball. Others say a version of the game was played in China as far back as the 3rd century BC. And the most interesting History fact of all, did you know how that how that bowling requires the highest IQ of all sports? Wow! Students are reminded to keep up with their belongings. Our lost and found pile is already growing at a ridiculous rate. If you are in the cafeteria hallway for breakfast, make sure you place your jacket on top of your backpack. If you if you take a jacket outside, bring it back with in with you. We are not going to be keeping lost and found items for the entire year like before. Get your things or they will be given to someone who needs them. Now please stand for a moment of silence.
Remain standing as we are led into the reciting of the Pledge of Allegiance by the second grade class of Miss Arthur. Thank you Cougars, make today a great day and don't forget to do your best. Woo!